welcome back so these are all the hormones that you're gonna have to study for your step one exam and I'm gonna have a separate video about each hormone but today we're gonna be talking about androgens whenever we say androgens we refer to androsterion which is secreted from the adrenal gland testosterone which is secreted from the testes and dihydrotestosterone which is testosterone converted by the enzyme 5-alpha reductase Potency wise, dihydrotestosterone is the most potent and androstenedione is the least potent. Other than 5 alpha reductase, we have another enzyme that acts on androgens, which is called aromatase. Aromatase is a cytochrome P450 enzyme and it converts androgens to estrogen. Now, testosterone is the medical type of testosterone. And it's used in patients with hypogonadism and burn victims because it's highly anabolic. Ironically, methyltestosterone inhibits LH levels, which are responsible for intratesticular testosterone, and this results in azospermia and testicular atrophy. In other words, you take methyltestosterone to increase the peripheral levels of testosterone, but it decreases the intratesticular levels of testosterone. Remember that this drug can cause premature closure of the epiphyseal plate, which might result in dwarfism in young patients, and it causes dyslipidemia by increasing LDLs and decreasing HDLs. To remember all these features, I remember the word belt. Dihydrotestosterone, however, which is the most potent type of testosterone, causes balding, acne, and development of due genitalia. I'm talking about a chick. With do genitalia. With do genitalia. That's gay. To remember the features of dihydrotestosterone, I remember the word back. Because androgens are highly anabolic, they're usually abused. They cause a lot of problems in all systems. So in the cardiovascular system, they cause polycythemia. In dermatology, they cause acne, and etc. And here's a small quiz for you. So what's the relation between androgens and the following enzymes? And here is the answer. All right, guys, that's everything I've got. Hopefully made this easier for you. Thanks a ton for watching, and I'll see you guys later.